Yo yo! What's going on guys? It's Boys Pilot 2K7 coming back with another Emerge NYC episode. Today we are in Ladder 66, Engine 32, and the 5th Battalion. We're hanging out here in the house watch area. So yeah, let's go ahead and hang out. Let's see if we get any calls and let's see what happens today, guys. Hi right, guys, so I just got a report of a, looks like a fire in a laundry mat. We're gonna go ahead and respond to that. Um, four nine and six eight are first due, but they are on another call. So we're gonna be going in first due to this one, guys. Let's go ahead and jump inside, release the brake, turn the lights on. Let's get going here. On taxi. May you guys stop right in front of us. Alright, let's see where are we going anyway. We have to go to six actually east twenty seven between six and fifth. The charm block goes down here. I think we're gonna take six uptown here. Alright, so again guys, we are responding to a fire in a commercial. It's gonna be a laundry mat. And of course guys, if you guys would like to see more Emerge NYC, definitely let me know by leaving some comments down below and hitting the like button. So in the last video, you guys really did enjoy it, so definitely want to bring you guys some more content. Alright, it's going to be on 27th here, which is going to be the next block, I think. Is the next one or a follow-up one? I think it's going to be the following block, actually. Alright, let's just look to see if we see anything. Yep, we got something showing here. Alright, there's a lot of traffic. We're just going to go around the block. Uh, 6 6 to Madden. Gosh, we got smoke showing. Still a block out. Update you once we get on scene. We could have went up the wrong way, but it's just traffic in this game is so stupid. I didn't feel like them running me off the road. <laughs> Let's get on scene. Let's assess the situation here. I right, got smoke. Yeah, we definitely got a smoke condition. In the laundry mat. Alright, so let's start operating. Alright, so let's go ahead and get to work, guys. Let's actually get our uniform on first. So let's put our turnout gear on. Alright, let's um get the outriggers out first. Oops. Oops. There we go. A little rusty, a little rusty. Alright, outriggers are coming out. Go ahead and put them down. We're going to have to search that floor above. Can't tell if we have fire or not, but we definitely have a heavy smoke condition. Let's go ahead and get on to the turntable up here. So it's going to place this ladder up to this window right here. Alright, and we're going to have to get our saw out now. Alright, 
like it's on this side. Alright, got a saw. So let's try to get this roll down to open up. Probably should have did that first, honestly, but that's the thing, when you're a one-man team, you kind of have to do everything yourself. Obviously, in real life, there's a lot more people here to help you out. Alright, so we're going to get ahead and cut the locks on the roll-up with the K-12 saw here. There we go. Oh, yep, yeah, we got a fire at Manhattan. 6-6 uh, six, six to Manhattan, 1075 to box. We have fire in a laundry mat, first floor. It's going to be a five-story mix-occupied. We can get entry into here too. I like to get everything opened up so that that way by the time we get the engine here, we could um we could just start focusing on flowing water. Why can't I hit this here? There we go. Oh, there we go. All right. Let's uh, check this door. Is this door open over here? Can we open that door? Let's put our saw back in. And we're going to also need our, oops, and this one actually. Camera views are a little funky sometimes, apologize about that. Alright, let me see if I could, can I force this door open? I don't think so. I can't force this door open. Alright, real quick, let's just do a quick primary search real quick. Actually, you know what, let's be smart about this. Let's be smart about this. Let's um put this back down. I don't want to hold on to too many tools. I want to put it there. All right, whatever you want to put it there. All right, let's grab a can. This may be a can job. You never know. All right, let's get in. We're going to go ahead and do our primary searches in here. Whoa, it's dark. All right, let's see if we can spray back some of this fire here. What the heck happened? Did I drop the can? What the hell? Right, let me get out of here. Alright, not sure what happened there. I think I dropped the can somehow. Can I pick it back up? Yeah, I don't know what happened to it. Alright, let's see if we can grab the other one over there. I don't think we could, but... I was just trying to go in there and do our searches, and we definitely have our can to kind of put back that fire. Yeah, I don't think we can take this one. All right, so what we're going to do, let's go ahead and switch to the engine. And let's bring the engine down. So we're going to bring down engine 3, 2. Let's go ahead and get to the fire. I like how all the truck sirens all sound slightly different. It's pretty cool. Oh my god, are you freaking kidding me guys? Come on. I wasn't thinking about the park. Oh no, that, that's not the same park. We're good, we're good. Damn, we are freaking fighting traffic right now, guys. Still a little bit of first person here. 
This would have been a really easy response for 4, 9, and 6, 8. But I just want to switch it up because we use 4, 9, and 6, 8 a lot, so. I want to give some of the other units some action here. Probably we can see the smoke. See the ladder is still up where we left it. That's a good sign. Come on, come on. Dang it, traffic, man. Alright, so let's try to hook up to a hydrant. Let's see how much the fire spread it already. I got a freaking hydrant right here. I'm just cut traffic off for a second so they can get out of our way. Alright, we got a hydrant right here, so we'll hook up to that. Park and brake on. Let's go ahead and jump out. Alright, so let's go ahead and get to work here. I don't know why I ran this way. Let's hook up to the hydrant right here. There we go. Let's go ahead and grab our wrench here. Alright, got that flowing. Let's put this back so we don't lose it. Let me turn off my siren so we don't have that rumble sound. There we go. Alright, let's go ahead and get some lines running in. Uh, looks like we don't have any extensions. Looks like the fire is contained to this area over here, which is good. So let's go ahead and grab our lines out here. Pull out an attack line. Stretch it out. Good distance. I think I want to get like one more length just to be safe. Ah, there we go. Alright, cool. Alright, so let's go ahead and start stretching this line into the fire apartment. Get some water flowing and see if we can knock down this fire. this up to here. Alright, so we get ready to start flowing water here, guys. Let's go ahead and grab the nozzle here. Let's take a look at our scene really quickly. Alright, so we need to try to get in there and knock out the fire. Let's try to take a cool screenshot here. Alright, let's get to work. Let's get to work, guys. Oh, don't tell me the nozzle broke. Are you freaking kidding me? Okay, I got it now. I thought it was broken. Alright, so I start pumping the water. We got water flowing. Alright guys, let's go ahead and get in there. Oops. Alright, let's knock this fire down, guys. Yeah, the smoke is so good, we can't see anything right now. Alright, let's move in. Got a little bit more burn in here. I got some more fire burning over here. Looks like maybe these dryers overheated. Uh, actually, these are washing machines. Maybe some electrical fault there. Overloaded circuit, maybe. Not too sure. Whoa. Right, the smoke is clearing up, guys. Actually, it's a pretty small laundry mat. Alright, guys. I think we knocked down the fire already, guys. I think we knocked it down. Yeah, like super laggy there. But yeah, guys. I think we knocked down the fire. I think we did it, guys. 
think we did that. Our, our line went right through the window there. Alright, so the fire has been knocked down. The ladder crew is going to go ahead and do their searches above the fire apartment above. But we have no extension. We were able to knock down the fire, which is good. So let's go ahead and um, turn the water off. Let's put this back. There we go. Let's uh, clean up the ladder here. We didn't even have to use it here. Alright guys, so the fire was under control. I think honestly we probably would have knocked that down before most of the units even came on scene. Alright, let's go ahead and get the, um, the outriggers down. And we'll bring them back in. Alright. Alright, so smoke has completely cleared, guys. We'll go ahead and go 10-8 here. We're going to head back to the station. So let's clean up all of these hoses here. Alright, got all the hoses up. Let's uh, disconnect from the hydrogen here. Actually, we got to turn it off first. Alright, we will put that back. And all we gotta do now is disconnect this here. And we'll put this back there. And we are good to go, guys. We are good to go. If only the cleanup was that easy in real life, I guess. <laughs> but anyway, guys, I do thank you guys for watching. Let me know if you guys would like to see some more Merge NYC. And um, yeah, guys, hope you guys enjoyed. Nice quick run. And um, yeah, I was able to knock out the fire. Also guys, let me know which um, units should we use in the next video. Let me know which other fire trucks we should use. But um, anyway guys, thank you guys for watching. Really do hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.